It's not the only local facility dealing with an outbreak. That's right, News Channel Live's Julia LeBlanc tells us about what's happening at a nursing home in Clay. As of today, we are caring for 26 residents with COVID-19. With another person at the hospital because of the virus. Elderwood at Liverpool sending out this automated message to families as they deal with a COVID outbreak, which hasn't let up since it started on November 12th. The virus taking the lives of three Elderwood residents, all starting with just one case. The first case they've had throughout the entire pandemic. In the last three weeks, 17 staff members have also tested positive for COVID-19. A spokesperson for Elderwood tells us they're working with the state to control the spread, saying, quote, in addition to continuing best practice infection control protocols, Elderwood has introduced new technology to aid in sanitizing the facility. In the meantime, they're doing what they can to stay fully staffed, shifting people around to fill the gaps. Please know that the care of our residents is our first priority. Elderwood is proactively testing its staff members and residents twice a week. But as soon as someone shows symptoms, they get a rapid test. If it comes back positive, their family gets a phone call and they're isolated right away to be closely monitored and cared for to the best of their ability. In Clay, Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. And here's a look at cases in nursing home in a couple of other counties. Wayne County reporting 31 active cases. Madison County reporting 20. Oswego County has 61 active cases in residents of an adult care facility, nursing home, group home, or assisted living.